Hey, what is up, YouTube? Welcome back to another episode of our pack and our track series. And uh, last episode was the live uh, edition we did in the stream, and uh, the packs are actually pretty bad. Pretty bad. Uh, I know we said we made a couple thousand coins, and that's... I don't know if we did or didn't. Uh, very, very close after really going back and looking through. The, the market's changing a lot right now. Uh, so it's going to be hard, so I'm probably going to undervalue things a little bit more this episode. Uh, because at the time I'm doing this, the market is a little bit down on especially the lower cards. So, we're going to try anyway. We're going to open 20 packs, as always. And pray. And pray we get something good. That we may or we may not. I don't know. Luis Castillo, good. Yuli Gurel, good. Tucker Barnhart, not good. So we got Castillo and Barnhart, right? And then Yuli. Okay. Not too bad. Now, if you guys aren't familiar with how we do this, we open up packs. I write down some cards. I look them up. If not, I assign a very generic-ish value to the pack based on quick sell values and prices and all that. Uh, and we see how we're going to do here. Now, with the way that the packs are going right here, normally I would have said this is like a 650. I feel like this is much more like a 550 now. Um, which sucks because I wish that was a 650 still which means it's going to be even harder to sort of make our stubs back at this point um, not impossible by any stretch uh, like again a Braves hat 200 stubs pretty good pull but you know people are starting to do the chipper program right now otherwise three bronzes three commons 550 750 760 so again we're not starting out great not, 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 not great. Not great. Another Braves hat. Good. Good. We'll always take that. I'm going to actually give this pack the same value of 650. Um, I would have liked. Uh, you gotta, you, we're going to have to get some silvers or a twins jersey. There we go. A twins jersey. has got a good sell price on it, generally. Twins. Uh, and we pulled the the stadium, so 100. Uh, carry the 5. All right, what do you guys think there? What do you guys think there? 675? 675 otherwise? Maybe. Maybe maybe that was a little on the high end. It could have been. Uh, now, we still haven't pulled like a diamond or like a really good gold out of this at all. Uh, 625 for that pack. Um, we haven't pulled anything good. We like we don't have a banger pull. And that's what a lot of the method is really based on, is that you can sort of stay even for a long period of time, and then you can hit that big pull, and you can either profit or keep the card. Maybe is that, that's what you want to do. Um, this pack, not not bad. These, all, these are actually all cards who will sell fairly quickly on the market. Uh, so I'm just going to call that 675. Um, again, a little bit lower from the way the market is. People are starting to stack up and wait for Team Epics. Once Team Epics come, and if they include cards from sets and teams, the prices are going up. So keep that in mind. Uh, we do get a silver and a gold. Chad Green. Not a good gold. Not a good gold. Hey, but he's a gold. And we also got Mr. Prado. Um, otherwise four players and that I mean that's 450 maybe 450 who's texting me let's see let's, let's, uh, let's see who's texting me my dad my dad cool he probably wants to know what is going on in the life of CC right now another Tucker Barnhart and a Phillies hat now I know Phillies hats are on 200 stubs at this moment uh, then we got three bronzes, two commons. Uh, not bad gold. Or not bad uh, bronzes. Not bad commons. So 510. So we got two packs left. And I mean, we are far behind. A diamond baseball will definitely help. And Mr. Yunel Escobar, free agent. Sucks for him. Uh, so the ball is 600, quick sell value, very easy there. 
four commons, not bad commons either, so 75 a pop for those probably, maybe 80. Uh, so 920, 910, we'll call that 1,000. I think that's 1,000 stub pack plus Mr. Escobar. Come on. Come on. Crap. Crap. Two Ricardo Rodriguez's, though. 650. Two Ricardo Rodriguez's. Cincinnati hat. Dropping in price. Dropping in price. Byron Buxton not dropping in price. He's a good pull. He's a good, 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 good pull. Uh, so we got 350 from the hat and the stadium. And we'll call it another 400 from the other cards. So 700. Not too bad. Um, we are we are way behind. Looking at our stubs, we are way behind. You know, I'm not counting the silvers or the golds or the the, the good stuff yet. But getting a Michael Conforto. Shout out to my my guy Tricky. I told him next time I pull Conforto, I would call him out. So there it is. Hopefully you watch, like you say you do. Otherwise, Zach Eflin's expensive. Orioles hats a hundred, two hundred, four hundred, five. 650 plus Conforto. Again, we're still we're losing stuff right now. Uh, or it's going to be very, very close. Very, very close. A four bronze round does not always mean it's a good round. Sometimes the commons go for a lot. Uh, so we'll just call it 650 and eat the garbage there. We need a good pull. Like, we need a legitimate good pull in this series. Uh, I'm just going to call that the same thing. I need a good pull. I need a good pull. We are, you know, I, I enjoy doing this. I, I do this regardless whether I'm hitting record or not. I do it the exact same way. Uh, Twins had starting to sell for a little bit more, 850. Um, but I want you guys to see me pull something. Like, I want to actually pull something for you guys. And it is increasingly getting harder and harder and harder. So we'll call it 600 before the Pirates uniform. I mean, we're only halfway there. A double silver pack. Bad silvers. Bad. I mean, Ellsbury and O'Day. Like, not good. Not good. Uh, the four commons aren't bad cards. That's 400. Trans hat's 500, 510. So we are going to need... we got three packs left. And we need about 9,000 stubs. Uh, including the stuff we wrote down. This is, not a, this, is a good, this is a good pack. This is a good pack. Colorado hat still is a little, a little expensive. So we'll call it 800. Two packs left. We need a diamond. I just want a diamond. Any diamond. Any diamonds is fine. I, I, I don't care at this point. Because that's a bad pack. 650. Oh my god. I think we might actually lose today. I think we might actually lose today. Uh, which is okay. We'll just call it 675. So we're at 13,280 stubs. That we... Uh, not, not, not doing great. So who do we get here? We got a Twins jersey uh which is 12 1250 okay that's not i mean that's that's good that's gonna help that's gonna help and then we also got a pirate's gold uniform which probably is not the most expensive thing 225. We'll hold on to that. It's going to go up in price at some point. We got a Darren O'Day. 589. That is uh, seems awfully high for him. 565. Put it as 500. Mark it in the books. Uh, did we get any Red Sox? We did not. We got Chad Green. Are you 2400? So uh, I think we're actually going to be okay. Between Green and and uh, Conforto are going to help us out a lot here. Ellsbury, sad, 400 stops. Wow. Okay. 
All right. Uh, no Rays, no Blue Jays. We did not get any White Sox, nor any Indians, nor any Tigers, nor any Royals. We did get a good twin, Mr. Buxton, who's always a thousand stubs. Always a thousand stubs. So cool, letter 900 there. Bam. Uh, no Angels, no Athletics, unfortunately. No Mariners either. No Rangers. We get an asteroid. We did. We got Yuli. Yuli Gurel. So we'll post Yuli here. We are going to barely again make it out of here alive. Um, that would be a lot. That's gonna take. It's gonna take a lot of selling. It's gonna take a lot of selling. It's gonna take a lot of selling. Um, but we're gonna make it. Uh, no Nationals, no Mets besides Conforto, right? Yep. 999. We'll call it 980. That gives us 880. <sighs> this was rough. This one was rough. Luis Castillo again, 999. Thank God we had a couple of good silvers, man. If we didn't have any good silvers, we were screwed. Just screwed. Two Tucker Barnhart's, like, not good. I mean, I'll take him over any bronze, but it does not help. I did enter a price over one. I hate, hate when it does that. All right, 720 for those two bad boys. Uh, and we also got... I think just you now, right? I think just Mr. Escobar. And that is correct. The highest rated free agent in the game, you now, Escobar. Uh, so we, we... This one's going to be really, really tough. Um, so we take all that, do a little taxation on it to see what our profit would have been. So we would have made 1,500 stubs. 1,500 stubs. It would be our profit today. Um, so, I mean, we'll add it to it. 26.49. Not great. Uh, especially for how many times we've done this. But again, that's still 26,000 stubs profit. I mean, if you're buying it on the market, that's 20 bucks, right? That's pretty good. Not great, but it's, it's, pretty, it's pretty good. We'll take it. Um, we're just waiting for the big hit, and hopefully we get the big hit soon. I will be back for another video on another day. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm out. Peace.